Today we'll be looking at how much paint is used on the Golden Gate Bridge every year. I'm sure the answer will surprise you. The Golden Gate Bridge is situated in San Francisco, California, USA and is the most photographed bridge in the world. It connects San Francisco with a quieter place called Marin County. They started building this bridge in 1933. Whilst it was being built, a large safety net was placed underneath it. This was a very good idea as it stopped 19 men from falling into the waters below, which almost certainly saved their lives. It took just over four years to build and was finally opened to the public in 1937. At the time, this was the longest and tallest suspension bridge in the world. On the very first day the bridge was opened, people were allowed to walk or cycle across it so that they could marvel at this amazing piece of engineering. The next day the bridge was open to vehicles and it cost 50 cents to cross each way. The total length of this bridge is 1.7 miles long or 2.7 kilometers. Whilst it only takes two or three minutes to drive across it, if you were to walk along its footpath instead, it would take about 30 minutes to venture from one side of the bridge to the other. As you walk or drive along, the top of the bridge towers above you by 152 metres. There's a good amount of room for ships below, as the distance between the bridge and sea level is about 75 metres, making the bridge's total height from sea level to the top at 227 metres tall. The footpaths and road combine a total of 27 metres wide, and the bridge weighs in at 380 million kilograms. If we were to include the weight of the approaches to the bridge, the whole thing totals 800 million kilograms. In 1965, they decided to remove the lead paint that had been previously used to paint the bridge. This was a big operation that took 30 years and wasn't completed until 1995. On the 22nd of February 1985, the one billionth driver crossed the bridge. To celebrate this, the driver was given a case of champagne and a hard hat. Since that time, another one billion drivers have crossed this bridge. You may be wondering about its colour. From some angles, it looks like it's red, but the colour they use to paint it is called international orange. When the parts for the bridge arrived in San Francisco during construction, they had a reddish-orange primer on them to stop them from rusting. They decided to keep this colour as it was highly visible for ships and fitted in well with its surroundings. So why is it called the Golden Gate Bridge? Was it ever painted gold? Well, the reason why it's called the Golden Gate Bridge is because the area it's in is called the Golden Gate Strait. The bridge itself has never been painted gold, but instead has always been painted orange. There have been rumours that these days they start by painting the bridge on one side and work their way to the other. Then when they get to the end, they start all over again, continuously painting the bridge. This rumour is false. But they do keep painting it in places that need a little patching up, so it is being constantly painted almost every day. If it wasn't being continually painted, the sea salt in the air would go through the paint and corrode the steel bridge, which would damage its structural integrity over time. So how much paint is used every year on the Golden Gate Bridge? It's estimated that 5 to 10,000 gallons of paint are used to paint this bridge every year. So this means that on average, about 20 gallons of paint are being applied to this bridge every single day. The Golden Gate Bridge is regularly examined and maintained to keep it in good operation and to keep it safe for everyone. Well, that's it for today. Thanks for watching all the way to the end. See you next time.